Welcome back inside the Suburban Ford 7 Sports Cave. It's time to ask the analyst. We're going to go into our control room right now. Oh. Mike Foss, the sports producer of this fine program. He's no analyst. <laughs> no, he is an analyst because he just, you know, he takes Twitter, he looks at it, and he says, I got stuff for you. Mike, what we got today? I, I analyze Twitter, so I guess that by very definition makes me an analyst. How very good. That? Very good, sir. Way very to save good. yourself. Very good. Well, uh, even though Jim Morris said don't talk about playoffs, we are definitely talking about playoffs this morning with the Pistons and the Red Wings both fighting for their playoff lives. So we'll go ahead and jump right into what the people are saying this morning using that hashtag 7 Sports Cave. Jeff says Pistons showing some attitude and swagger needed a component to get to the next level. Now don't overdo it. Matt says if the Pistons play better defense and Reggie Jackson shoots better, this team could get to the second round. And Ray with a question, what's your favorite opening in sports? NCAA tournament first round, NBA or NHL playoffs or opening day? Ooh, Ray, great question. Guys, I got to go with the first day of the NCAA tournament on that one. But that's because I love college sports more than anything else. You guys? I am a pro over college guy just because the... Um, the mirage of amateurism sort of bothers me a little bit. Okay, yeah. <laughs> that's for that's that's fair. Fair. for another day. I'm with you. The opening day of the NCAA tournament, all of the games, all of the brackets, it's like a national holiday. It's the best. Even when Michigan State loses to a 15 seed. That's mm. the beauty of it. Hey, I should be in Houston right now, which is <laughs> great. You. That's the beauty of it. I mean, of you know, Michigan State losing, who would have thought? Who would have thought? thought? Everyone I who didn't. filled out their bracket would right, have thought right, otherwise. And I think that's why the NCAA is what it is. Yeah. Lindsay, when they talk about the, the swagger that the Pistons have, I really like that Stanley Johnson came out and kind of defended Detroit, defended the Pistons against Kevin Durant saying, who cares about Detroit this week? When you hear a young guy, a rookie, come out and kind of be like, all right, I'm circling that date next year for when we play you guys again. Is that, that swagger, that attitude, that, that Detroit basketball kind of, you, you, what do you, when you see that, do you like that? Well, I like the fact that, you know, you always defend your team, regardless, good, bad, or indifferent. You know, you go in the locker room and tell a guy if he says something stupid, hey, don't say that again, but you defend <laughs> him in front of everybody right. and, you know, other teams. You know, uh, creating a rivalry, I don't know how much of a rivalry it is because if Kevin Durant decides to sign with the Pistons, what is everybody going to say? No, you don't come here because <laughs> we argue with you and you hit it on our city. What are we going to do? Right. Open sign arms. Yes. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so that's a different, you know, that's kind of different. But I do like the fact that these guys have an edge. They have an edge. You have to have an edge, you know, to get to the next level. And, and Westbrook is the guy with the biggest edge in the NBA. So, you know, I, I like the fact that they, they're playing with a little swag, a little edge. By the way, Kevin Durant's watching right now. So, Kevin, you just heard from, <laughs> from Lindsay that you got to come to Detroit and play here for the Pistons. But, no, it, it is fun to, to definitely talk about Pistons basketball in a playoff-type atmosphere coming up here at the Palace. And I think that, uh, what, one more home game, two more home games? What do they got? Home games. Two more home games. Get out there before it's too late because, you know, they might not make the playoffs. But then there will be playoff games. games. There will be. <laughs> You're saying it here. You're, are, you, are you making a guaranteed? <laughs> Um, uh, sure. No, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right, whatever. <laughs> all right, coming up next, we got a special guest in the house. Tigers Authentics is here to talk about some of the coolest stuff that you can find. Oh, wave, Mark. Hi. <laughs> We're going to talk about some of the coolest stuff you can find and buy for your man cave at home. Coming up next on the Suburban Ford 7 Sports Day. Stay with us.